Ballyho everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Saga Frontier Remastered. So as I said whenever I, I haven't really done much because um, we're not going to start grinding just yet. Um, I'm trying to think. Okay, we need to go to, we're going to go to Yorkland today. Actually, hold on. Let me go talk to Amelie. I want to see what her text is for that. So we're going to go to Yorkland. And let's go on a ship. And she didn't have any additional text there, okay. Let's go to Yorkland. Alright, so we come this way. And we're looking for... He bought... He brought in just about everyone he could to cure. Doctors, priests, you name it. I heard she's not feeling well. Poor thing. He lives here. Finally adopted a daughter, but she's very ill. Huh. Here in the way. Watch from over there. Ah, I meant to talk to the fairy. No, fairy. Apparently not. Okay. Anyway, it's not obvious. We're supposed to go talk to the billionaire. So let's come over here. Did you come to kill my daughter? Yeah. I don't care who or what you are as long as you can help my daughter. In fact, I'm is trying to help her right now. more than I can handle. That's how it usually goes. What's happening? Was that fun? Sleeping. The ring. The girl is mine. You will not interfere. Uh, Molosite. What was that? Looks like she's possessed. Obtain ring and retreat. Wait. Wait. Uh, <clears throat> that was mailing Santa, sorry. Wait. Maybe the ring's power is keeping her alive. Just like Quarkmel? Yes. No. She deserves to live to be a Kurama. Riki, let's go to Kurama. I know of a doctor there who's specialist who's who's a specialist on this. Yes, we get to recruit today. And this is one of the reasons that I wanted to come uh, do this before doing the grinding. We're going to go see the doctor. You know what's sad is I don't ever remember what voice I gave him. I'm probably giving him a different voice every time I've talked as him. Um, absorb the rat bat. Suck blood. Yeah, we are a rat bat. That's probably not a good thing. 
That did not mean to go down the... <sighs> there we go. Are you waiting? Next, please. Are you a patient? No. Maybe he is a quack. Riki explains the situation. Mm, I usually don't make house calls. It's for the billionaire's daughter. He'll pay whatever you ask. Unlimited fee. Sounds interesting. So yeah, Dr. Nusakan has joined us. And he will stay with us after this little escapade. So... As our resident magic user, we're going to replace loot. He hasn't got magic yet, but that's what I was gearing him up for. Uh, so we are going to take off all of his gear. And real quick, like, we're going to do the best we can with what we have to work with. Um, Looking at those protections. Yeah, actually the hard leather is probably the better of them at the moment. Um... Yeah, no, that, about the best things I can give him is the York hat and probably the, the leather glove, yeah. Okay. And we'll take off those because we've got the Lethal Dragoon. Yeah, we'll leave him with the water cannon, actually. And we'll give him a couple of repair kits for the sake of protecting uh, that. We may be able to uh oh if you didn't notice the money the one thing i did is i did make a money run over by almy so yeah i didn't go back and rebuy gold gold ingots but as long as i don't spend over fifty thousand, we're okay okay i actually just wanted to do that so i could get over here we're gonna get another powered suit um yeah, we're gonna go ahead and pull those. And I can't move that. I can move it up and down, I think, but I can't. There we go. And we'll give him the steel amulet, just because we can. <clears throat> All right. And should I get another powered suit for? Let's see here. If I was to give this to him instead of the power cannon or the hand cannon. Actually lowers his HP. That's pretty funny. How about the missile pod? That is actually better than the missile pod except for the concentration, but I'm using him as a sword user, so. Oh wait, why do I want to take off the jump parts? What do they do for oh yeah, they do almost nothing for him. So let's put this down here. And let's find the best... Oh, the Katana gives him a decent amount of HP. And mobility. Okay. Let's equip him with a Katana. Now, is there anything better than the Katana I can equip to him right now? The Missile Pod. Yeah, no, the Missile Pod. Nah, not the scrap bazooka, I'm one of the missile pod. And then we'll give him a katana just for the stats. There we go. Okay, if I get him another null blade, that'll actually be better than the katana. We can ignore that. Because I forgot to put my phone on silent. I'm a professional let's player. No, I'm not really. I do this as a hobby. Um. <laughs> All right, Doctor Nuscon. He is going to be our. Honestly, he's probably going to be our healer because uh, I can get him. I don't really have to give him magical heal, but I do need to give him absorbs that give him uh, magic abilities. So he's going to have his 
JP for attack and his WP for a healing and assisting, is what I'm thinking. Uh, plus, he's already got Dark, which is actually really good, uh, or Shadow, I mean. And he also has Arcane already. I could give him Rune, but I plan on giving Rune to Feyon. Uh, I'm not sure what else. I actually haven't 100% thought out my team. Um, with Dr. Nusikon, we can go get um, Misartha. And that would allow me to replace... So, I may go get Misartham and replace T260. I'm thinking. Well, I mean, not T260, but ultimately in the team that I was going thinking of, T260. Because I was going to use T260. But I would replace Mei-Ling at the moment. Let's just finish this for now. Now, we don't have any absorbs yet, um, probably, probably, actually, what, did he start with anything absorbed? No. Okay. Please help her. Yeah. Sleeping. You know what to do? Well, for the sake of this, I'm gonna say got no idea. First, we let Molosite possess her. Then, it won't be able to get away easily. This is our chance to beat it. If we damage it too much, it'll run. So damage it gradually. The truth is mine! You will not interfere! Alright, so... You can damage it, but don't damage it much. Um... Yeah. So you want to just kind of... Just dental damage. In fact, I'm just going to have him defend because of how much damage he could do. Um... We'll use Feyblade. I don't think I can absorb it, but we're going to try to just use Feyblade. Uh, just punch. Just punch. Yeah, just, just, you know, gentle damage here. Fang, defend. In this case, I wonder if I can just use the mystical shawl. Is that going to heal her blind? I actually don't know if it does. It might only do poison. Yeah, only does poison. Okay. Everybody ready? It's almost time. Hold up. Uh, actually, you have Grail, don't you? Yes, yes. I'm thinking about it, and looking at the way my team's going to be set up, 
I may want to keep uh, T260. There we go. Now that he, now that Molosite's attempting to possess her, now he's stuck. And with that, we now destroy him. Or it. Because I actually don't know if it's supposed to be male or female. This is an evil spirit, though, so... I don't know if Rolling Cradle is going to work, but we're going to try. And we use Ogre Rush. Ogre Rush, Rolling Cradle. Okay, maybe it is going to work. Well... Yep, so now it's on a timer. We have to kill it before it uh, actually kills her. Hold up. Yeah, he's not really hitting us that hard, but... Yeah, why don't I do that? And there goes the battle. And we're absorbing Malsite. Okay. And we got the generation. We're not a mushroom. And he got his mystic gloves. Nice. We did it! Dad. Thank God. Thank God. Thank you, everyone. I will give you whatever you want. Here, take this. You can't get the ring, you'll... I'll be alright, Dad. Besides, the ring told me that it wants to be with its brothers. Riki has its brothers, right? Yeah! Good luck. Thank you very much. Now, you can actually come and get money from him, like, multiple times uh, until he says, no, please, no more. We're just going to leave him alone. Dr. Nusikun. He is very much a not evil Hojo. I mean, I'm not going to say he's a good guy, but he's definitely not a bad guy. Anyway... I definitely wanted to bring him into the group, and there is one other character, but there's that I want to use because I'm not really getting to get much of a chance to use them again. But the problem is that that's going to involve doing the magic quests. Now, I have an issue with that. I cannot do the runic quest because of Riki's uh, circumstance. Having to fight Tanzer and not having access to the Vitality Room before leaving Tanzer means that, just like with Red, you can't get the runic uh, there. And also, our trip to Despair is also going to prevent us from getting uh, <clears throat> the magic that we want there. So, what we are going to do, however, is... Is there anyone I need light magic for? Aside from alien. Um... Feyon. Do I want Feyon to have light or dark? Mm. I'm trying to think. I know Dr. Nusikon has shadow, and I'm thinking maybe give Feyon light? That would give, what does that give him advantage-wise? It does give him Light Blade. 
And as we found with the Mystics, using Solar Blade for Deflect is not a bad idea. So I can have him use Solar Blade, give him the stat buff from Solar Blade, and then use his hand-to-hand -hand attacks. Is that worth it compared to Shadow Magic? He's not going to be using the Shadow Magic that much, though. I think it is. I think I just want to go ahead and give him Light. Because that'll also let him use Starlight Heal and give him Flash Fire in the case of needing an AoE. He's not that great with magic to start with, but you can make him decent with it. <clears throat> and then by Shadow Magic and Dr. Nusikan already has Power Grab, but let's give him the purchase Hide Behind and Shadow. Um, shadow net with him. Uh, those two, we'll just let them get shadow since I'm fixing to go do, go ahead and oh no, I need to ask her about shadow magic. And this is uh, utilize a shadow and illusion. We're not going to be getting any more human, and we probably could get if we were going to go get Masartha, we would want to do that before going to get um, well the shadow shadow gift actually or or the light gift. But I think I know what I'm going to do. I think I'm gonna keep T260 to give us a uh, mech that we can we can teach some abilities to, and I'm gonna going to use Riki and Dr. Nusikan or N Nusikan. Oh my God, I can't believe I did that. Um, as our healers, Riki will be a good healer having magical heal already, and the form that I'm going for is going to have. A decent bit of durability. They return with a gift for shadow magic. And we're gonna come this way. And Mailing and Feyon are just gonna, you know, go to the labyrinth, uh, luminous labyrinth, and come back. That's right, Riki and. Uh, and T260, they can't actually go through the Luminous Labyrinth or Omble, period, because mechs and monsters cannot go to those areas. And mechs and monsters technically can go to uh, Omble, but they can never return. They're stuck there. So, we're going to go ahead and go to Devon. And while we can't complete the rune quest, we can get runic magic for anyone we want to use it. So, let's go ahead and purchase for Fey on Vitality Rune, possibly Victory Rune, and for Mei Ying as well. Or Mei, Mei Ling as well. Mei Ying. Oh god. <clears throat> And we're going to go ahead and make sure Dr. Nusikon has all of these magics. And we're actually going to come in and ask about the gift. Alright. So we're done for the preparation for the magic quests. But before we do the magic quests, there is one other thing I want to do, and this is where I'm going to I'm going to set it up. Oh, we're going to go to the Magic Kingdom. Um, I probably could have come here after I got the accessories and such. That's okay. This won't take long to set up. So we're going to buy Realm Magic for... We're actually going to... We're going to break Dr. Nusikin's uh, magic. We're not going to... Well, we could give it to Feyon just to have a, a couple of spells to learn. That way I can give him mastery. And same thing with Mei Ling. Um, at this point, I might as well just turn her into a mage because it's a, a mage is going to be replacing her, technically. Uh, and I meant to go to Manhattan before I came here. I need to keep an eye on how much money I'm spending. Oh, uh, that's the schemer's ring. Oh, I'm over. Guess we're going to the same place. 
Okay, so we are going here. We're not going here for the ring, but we are going to come in here for the accessory shop. And, oh look, the Lord of Almy bought the Schemer's Ring. So yeah, so we can't get the Schemer's Ring. Um, we are going to buy a whole mess of these. This is going to break me. Um, I'm looking at the money. Yeah, I'll be okay. I don't know. Let go. Um, we are going to end up going to Almy as well, hilariously. Um, because I need to go ahead and get money. Alright, so the healer's ring. The problem with those rings now is the fact that they're going to get in the way of me getting my defensive items on. So, let's put on the harmonium earring. Not the... I have two harmonium here, oh my god. The, uh... Yeah, those two. And actually, I, I can't. I, oh no, I can, but they don't. Um. So let's take off the hand cannon. I think is the hand cannon. Yeah, the hand cannon's actually not as good. So I don't need the. I don't know why I bought the purple eye for him, but I can give him the harmonic to make him immune to Sonic. Alright, purple eye. Definitely get purple eye on him. Harmonium earring. Mei Ling, we'll get rid of those. Probably go ahead and get rid of that. Actually, I probably should have waited until I get her a powered armor. Uh, yeah, we'll leave him with this too. Mm -hmm. Oh, Moonlight Robe. Actually, let's give it that. And the harmonium earring. And the purple eye. And the harmonium earring and the purple eye. Okay. Okay. So we go to the port. We go to Kirong because I can't exchange here in Manhattan for whatever reason. We go to Ami. Nelson. Dash on over here. And go ahead and buy back all the gold we can. Oh good. I did leave myself with just enough. Now I am going to try to make this a little bit of a shorter episode because, and, and I, I apologize for anyone who likes the longer episodes because I like making the longer episodes. But my internet is not happy with me, and it is getting to be a point where it's it, the longer episodes, like the ones that are like an hour long, are taking me a day and a half to upload, and it's like, ugh. It's your favorite spot, huh? Anyway, we're actually going to come this way. Yes, we're going to Ferdo's workshop. Now... Anyone who has uh, played the game and, and knows this, Ferdo is... Or anyone, well, if you're watching this, you probably watched my other episodes. Ferdo is a master at petrification. Um... And that's actually why we're here. Because Ferdo is a master at petrification. And that actually means that you can absorb him... For stone gas, I believe it is. I don't know what it's called here anymore. It might be crystallizer. Um, actually, now that I think about it, it's probably crystallizer. But that's just it, is that he can give you crystallizer. An ability you couldn't otherwise get this early. Oh, and that, this is going to be a hard fight. Actually, that might be a bad idea. Can use power grab. Um, I forgot to give her her abilities. We'll just use Sunray, and we'll use Ever Rush. Well, I'm glad we have the Harmonium. Again, I'm glad we have the Harmonium. 
Oh, does it only do strength down? Well, that's annoying. I wonder if you can absorb this guy. We can try. I can't hear you! <laughs> okay, Doctor. You show off. What did that give him? Because I don't know what that does. Oh, it gave him Griffin Strike! I'm not mad. Confused, maybe, but not mad. Okay, let's give him Energy Chain. For now, we're gonna get rid of that and get back Implosion. <laughs> Griffin Strike. And it's a 2020! That is actually a really good... Mmm. Okay, that was worth it. I'm... I'm keeping it regardless. Anyway, we gotta get to... Was there anything up here? No, there wasn't. Okay. We gotta get up here to Ferdo's room. And so this is what we're going to do. I'm going to save right here on this save file. And let me show you what I'm probably going to be doing off screen unless I happen to get it first time. Because Ferdo has four moves, just like most monsters, that you can absorb from him. And the hardest one to get is Stone Gas. I mean, with Griffin Strike, though, and the increased strength from learning it, it's probably not going to be that hard to try to farm. My god, I can't believe I got Griffin Strike so early. I wasn't even going to give him Griffin Strike, but I'm going to keep it. Uh oh Glass Shield. This is going to suck if Nukasin's the first one to hit him. Um, it just ignored it? Okay. Oh, Oh, Riki, I'm so sorry. Oh, Riki, I'm so sorry. Hey, you ain't half bad. Okay, so I'm actually gonna have her... Uh... Bring him back up. Oh, wait, no, that was her, actually. That was the one I was thinking of. I'm gonna have her use Starlight Heal on Riki. Petrifying gas. He's trying to petrify the robot. Please let Riki get back up. Okay, thank you. Jeez! Oh my god, what kind of luck? Wanna go around again? Fifteen hundred on the first, uh, just by itself. No combo necessary, 1500 at this stage of the game. I'm glad he's trying to petrify the robot because the robot's petrify proof. The only way I could get more insane luck is if I happen, come on tough guy, how about it? if I happen to get stone gas on the first try. It's not gonna happen. It's just not gonna happen. You know how many people would be willing, ready to hunt me down through my computer screen if I got stone gas on the first shot? Oh no! Don't petrify him! He might die this turn! Okay, he didn't. Good. Yeah, he did die this turn, too. I'm glad I didn't fresh by him. Okay. Moment of truth. So, Riki can absorb Ferdo. Gremlin Touch. 
So that's the kind of thing that I'm expecting. Ferdo is going to be dying a lot. And... I may see if Ettens are good for New Sakan's weapon, because, or not weapon, but gloves. Because if they are, I may be doing that. So this is actually what we're going to call it here in the middle of Ferdo's workshop. When we come back, we will probably be trying to basically go ahead and get the card quest done so that we can get our last party member so we can actually start building up our team properly. But until then, we hope to see you again. Later, folks. Dance, Ricky, dance.